No, for some reason, it looked kind of familiar when I first it saw it, does. but I can't remember where I might have seen that. Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash. I'm sitting there thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on Rappers React. They're talking about us on YouTube. Hollywood 6, it look like I do magic. Maybe he's practicing voodoo. I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention. Well, I'm here to say that we do, too. Deliver the rubbish. I'm What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of Rappers React. Smoke dog. What I Guess what I got for you? Uh... It's not a new car, is it? Man, I, I would love to give you a new car. Yeah, you. me too. It's not, though. But I bet it's probably trivia. You're right. You got <laughs> it, it, buddy. It's trivia. How about this? Um, What was Muhammad Ali said to float like? A butterfly. You were correct. Okay. What did uh, Who did Barack Obama marry in 1992? Michelle. I don't know what her maiden name is. I was going to ask they want to know. Yeah. Uh, no idea. Um, Jackie Onassis? No. Jackie He was Kennedy. A, uh Jackie He was a I think Joiner Kirsty. I uh, think he was an Olympic guy, Jackie Robinson? Oh, that was a baseball player. Baseball player. Okay. So it was Michelle Robinson? Yes. Ah. Before Michelle Obama. Alright, how about this? How many rings are there on the Olympic flag? Is it seven? No, I can give you multiple choice if you would like. Oh, I thought it was four on top of three on bottom. Uh, what is it? Would you like multiple choice? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so you got three, four, five, six, huh. or seven. I guess it's five then. You sure? Yeah. You're right, buddy. Yeah. You're right. For some reason, I was thinking there was four on top, three on bottom, but it's three on top. You're right. I, I was. Mean, I yeah, was three on bottom. Top, I was thinking. Yes, because it's yeah. like it's like five on the bottom. I, anyway, we're thinking the same thing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. So, <clears throat> um, man, I don't want to get out of bed and drive there because that is so blank away. Far. Okay. All right. Um, um, what's blank the veil? Beyond. Oh, wow. I'm surprised you got that one. Okay. All right. How about this one? Um, one of the most common words in English language. The. All right. Some flat earthers would say this is not ninety-three million miles away, but it's in or the sun. Is that it? Uh, far beyond the sun. You got it, my <laughs> friend. <laughs> guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big, big favor, y'all. Yeah, please hit that thumbs up button, guys. Please subscribe to the channel and for god's sake leave us a comment and tell us what to react to next that's how we get the ideas for these videos come directly from you right down in the comment section and over on, on patreon. patreon and today we have another wonderful suggestion from one of our wonderful patreon members who goes by the name of morris, morris gotro yes yeah. shout out to morris listen this yeah. guy has been around for a while. Absolutely. Morris is a true trash talker. Absolutely. He I, definitely is. Yes, he is a true patron member. He mm -hmm. is a true tribe member. Shout out yes. to Morris Control. And Morris Control, I'm looking you dead in your eye right now. You are what we would consider a true trash talker. Mm -hmm. There's a few out there, but you are one of them, my friend. Absolutely. But you have sent over a person... Yeah, I had to look up this name before we started because I saw him on the list there, and I had no idea how to say that. But go ahead, buddy, give it a try. Uh, apparently, it's Ingve Malmstein. See, if I saw that, I would have said Youngway. <laughs> Youngway Malmstein. Malmstein. I, Malmstein looks right. Yeah, but, uh, Ingve. Well, see, man, that's so weird because when the Ingve, mm -hmm. so the V would be the. The W. The W. Yeah. Well, that could be like um, European, right? Yeah, yeah. European. You know, the 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 German used that. As Correct. The the V for a W. Hmm. But yeah, um, no idea. I have no idea. Who uh, this yeah, is. this is something new to us, and this is why Morse Gotro is so 
like when we say a certain type of Patreon members, this guy is one that literally comes out and just brings us the most random things. Yeah. Ingve and we yes. we've never seen this in a comment. Have you ever seen this in a comment? No, for some reason it looked kind of familiar when I first it saw it, does. but I can't remember where I might have seen that. God dang it, you're right, it does look familiar. Yeah. Maybe right. it wasn't a comment or a suggestion before. But see, here's the the, the dope thing about Morris being uh-huh. a Patreon member. Morris will send us some of the most out of the way things. Oh yeah. And it'll erratic things. Yes, yes, dude. And it'd be I you know what? Alright, so the name of the song is Far Beyond. The Far Beyond the Sun. Yeah. What do you think? What genre? Don't tell me what the song's about. What the Ooh. genre's about. Exactly. You have no <laughs> clue when it comes to when Morris comes yeah, out. Yeah. What what genre you got? I wanna say like classical again, maybe. I mean that sounds like a you know, a classical singer maybe, uh someone from the opera. <laughs> It's hard to tell. You know, he didn't he send us that the Hang 'em High yeah. operatic. He also Ooh. sent us the um Damn, how Stevie you... Ray Vaughan. Oh, we just can we just did Blues Week last week and yeah. Stevie Ray Vaughan. That yeah. dude is amazing. Oh yeah. No, but what does far beyond the sun mean? Just going oh, far out there, yeah. Like dude, you're 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 not even close to where we are. You're just <laughs> yeah. out there. That dude's so out there, he's past the sun at this point. Smoked out. What up? Let's get into it. Let's do it. Special edition. Huh. Additional, Wow. 
Alright, he's having sex with the guitar. Yeah. Can we just be honest here? say his name but I feel like we're pronouncing it wrong yeah maybe I feel like Morris just knows where to find the greatest guitarist I think you're right <laughs> yeah. I think you're right I think Morris knows where the okay there are levels to guitar <laughs> yeah. guitarism yeah you've yeah. got your your t- your your what is it they call it like the S tier is the highest right the S tier you have S tier A tier Anyway, okay. <laughs> it's like in a video game. Term. Oh, okay. But, okay, you got your medium guitar players. <laughs> yeah. Give me a medium gu- guitar player. Give me one. Who's oh, man, medium? that's tough to say because everybody, there's going to be somebody say, no, he's the best, you know. I don't know. Uh, Jack Black. Okay, Jack Black. Let's let's just Actually, ta- he's pretty good, too. He is though. very yeah. good. So, but let's take him as medium. Mm-hmm. Now, A tier, I'm going to put... God dang it! You're right. That I is know, hard it's to tough say. because yeah, there's gonna be somebody take issue with whatever name you throw out. You're right, and then they'll be like, "Well, you need to watch this because this is gonna prove that this guy is great." All I'm gonna say is, please pronounce this guy's name for me. Uh, Ingve Malmstein. Okay, Ingve Malmstein. Yeah. He, if I'm being honest, I have to put him on the level of what I've just seen. I don't know what yeah. his other work is. He's up there with Stevie Ray Vaughan. Yeah. And Jimmy. I wonder if you should make uh, like a determination between the blues guitarist or the metal guitarist. Mm. Like, cause this guy might be one of the best metal guitarists ever. I mean, maybe he's up there with with, with Slash and and uh, Van, Halen Van Halen and guys like that. Yeah. yeah. Whereas you you might want to put Stevie Ray Vaughan and Jimi Hendrix on a different level. You know what I'm saying? No, maybe not level, but. A different category. Yeah, we say that though, but what what cha- what classifies them as putting them into different categories? Like, what? Why do we put a uh, Stevie Ray Vaughan in a Jimi Hendrix? Is it just because of their genre? Yeah, because they're both blues trained guitarists rather than metal. metal. Yeah. Huh. But I mean, I, I don't, I don't know. Like, uh, maybe it's the location or whatever that he doesn't get really thrown out there when people talk about Slash, Van Halen, and guys like that. I will say I've never heard of this guy. Have you? No, no. Never. Maybe maybe the reason it looked familiar because his name might have actually come up when we were doing, doing the, the greatest guitarist. guitarist. Yeah. yeah, you're right. Now, what I will say is he definitely belongs in that category. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm yeah. not I'm not trying to stroke his ego or anything like that, but yeah. this dude can play the hell out of his <laughs> Apparently. He pulled the <laughs> yeah. Did he play with his tongue? Oh or my god. Teeth, or his maybe. teeth. Yeah, probably. I mean, how do you even I mean I've I've seen guys pull that trick off before. Like I wanna say Hendrix might have done that before. Oh I did uh no, I don't think it was Hendrix. I wanna say it was Slash for some reason. Was it? I I don't know. I've seen that trick pulled off before though where they, they try to you know Use their bite out a few yeah. cores. <laughs> God, I'm sure Steve Ray Vaughan has done it before. Oh, I wouldn't doubt it. Sure, he can play behind his back, <laughs> dude. That if y'all haven't seen our Steve Ray Vaughan reaction from Blue yeah. Week, please go check that out. Steve Ray Vaughan convinced us that he is the best guitar He's player the best. ever. But again, say this guy's name for me. Uh, Ingve Mumstein. Okay. This guy, I'm not going to say he's better. I'm not going to say he's worse. But yeah. God dang, he definitely rivals. <laughs> he's in the conversation. He's in the conversation. Absolutely. 
Morris Gotro, thank you so much for all your love and support on Patreon. You have been a true supporter from day one. Uh, pretty close. I mean, he was there in the early days. You were there forever, guys. Mm -hmm. And this is the power of Patreon. You, we didn't know who the hell. What's his name is? I'm, I'm using you. Ingve <laughs> Malmsteen. Ingve Malmsteen. I, I'm, I'm, I hope that's right. That's just the way the the Google, Google pronunciation. Yeah. So. I, I would try to do it, but I can't. <laughs> but um, no. I mean, this is the power of Patreon. Morris came through and said, "Hey, you guys think Stephen Ray Vaughn's amazing? Wait till you check this guy out." But mm -hmm. this is this shows you the prime example of Patreon. And guys, if you want to support us, the best way to do that is through Patreon. And, guys, let us know what's next by Ingve Malmsteen down in the comment section. And with that being said, my name is Behringer Hollywood 6. Bye. I am Larry Smokey Ramirez. Come and on. we are over and out. Deuces. I want to thank you guys for tuning in to another segment of Rappers React. If you guys want to see another artist that we covered, just click uh, right here. If you want to see the last video did, just click right over here. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of time with us today. Please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already, and we'll see you on the next one. Deuces.